So I did a video like this about a week ago and you guys really liked it. So I'm doing another one. 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 Funniest kid test answers part two. Also, I am doing an Instagram following spree. So just go ahead, follow me on Instagram. I'm gonna follow you guys right back. Click the first link in the description below. I'm obviously not gonna be able to follow everybody back, but I'm gonna follow as many people back as I can, so. But let's go ahead and get into it. Notification squad, squad? Notification squad. Notification squad, research squad, let's do this. All right, so this kid's name's Frankie. I earn money at home by I don't. I am a freeloader. I've never really heard somebody admit, hey, I'm a freeloader. I mean, gee, I mean, who wants to be known as the freeloader? I guess we know who's not gonna get a prenup later on in life, Frankie. Complete the opposite meanings of the following. Okay, that's easy. Open, closed, over, under, oral, yes please, what? Is this the same kid who was the freeloader in the last one? Oral, yes please, is it free? I mean, gee, I don't know. It's the teacher's fault, to be honest. Like, how are you gonna go from open, closed, over, under, oral? I mean, what do you expect the kid to put down? Oral, yes please, man, get that out of here. Two plus two equals four. Nigga, we made it. Hey. Damn, we made it. When I was in kindergarten, I always put two plus two equals five, baby. I can do meth. Don't you know that drug is illegal? This ain't breaking bad. This kid obviously meant I could do math, but like you had to pick one of the most hardcore drugs. You could have said I can do weed, not meth. I like Mrs. Edwards. She is my tetcher. Donald Trump has only been in office for a week and already our kids are spelling worse. I like when she does meth with us. What is with all these kids and doing meth? Do all of these kids go to the same school? Draw and color three six of a set, then complete the sentence. Oh, okay, the kid drew butterflies okay that's nice got like you know a few got six butterflies a few of them are colored in three six of the butts are colored what i thought they were butterflies three six of the butts are colored that's racist this is a really poopy situation give the man a bonus point or the stick figure gets it and then the teacher writes I don't negotiate with terrorists i don't know maybe if like the drawing was a little bit better and maybe if the stick figure's arms weren't coming out of their necks. Your arms ain't supposed to be up here, it's supposed to be down here. Okay, for this one, pretty straightforward. You got a rat, so you put in the A for rat. You got a six, you put in the I for six. On the bottom, you got a picture of a sad face, so you're supposed to put STD. <laughs> <laughs> look how sad the sad face is. But look at the face of the rat. The rat is looking down at the sad face like, and I gave them the STD. These kids are freaks. There's a horse. Okay, got a horse at the top, so I guess this, they're gonna write about horses. That's nice. And they put whores. They spelled horses wrong, and they put whores. Even if they meant whores, they spelled whores wrong. You had one job. Spell horses right. All right, let's go ahead and read this kid's story. It says, I like whores. <laughs> Join the club. No, no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Whores. Have other whores friends. Okay, um, this is getting, this is getting a little bit ridiculous. Whores like carrots. You wow didn't think they cowed. This kid just forgot the L twice in wooden and could. So they spelled wowden and cowed. But they could put their legs straight up. Whores make you feel good. <laughs> Okay, this kid has gotta be doing this on purpose. My dad wants a whores, but my mom says no. Yeah, that sounds about right. When I am 16 or 20, I will buy my own whores. Boy or girl, stop. <laughs> stop. You can't buy whores. Well, actually you can buy it. You, yes, yes, you can buy whores, you can. Wow, that's the best story I've ever read in my life. Tapeworms are hermaphrodites. What is meant by the term hermaphrodite? Lady Gaga. Wh why, why? 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 What did Lady Gaga do to you? I mean, come on, like, do you even know what a hermaphrodite is? Hey Siri, what's a hermaphrodite? A hermaphrodite is an organism that has reproductive organs normally associated with both male and female sexes. Many taxonomic groups of animals do not have separate sexes. In these groups, hermaphroditism is a normal condition, enabling a form of sexual reproduction in which either partner can act as the female or male. Oh, okay, I mean, that was very educational. I learned something new today. Hey, find X. Here it is. Well, dang. They just put a circle around X and, and they, they found X. Why you mad, bro? Why you mad? Catch me outside, how about that? What do we call the science of classifying living things? 
racism. Or you can call it Donald Trumpism. Okay, it says, good morning. Today is a free write day. You may choose your own topic to write about in your journal. So they put, tomorrow I'm not going to be here because I'm going to be in vagina. <laughs> gonna be in what this ain't a strip club on saturday night you can't be in you can't be doing that this kid obviously meant virginia but they wrote vagina for some reason i'ma cut this kid a break because you know i get the two words mixed up all the time so boys they have ding dongs and girls they have virginias what is the strongest force on earth they put love and the teacher marked it wrong what the heck siri do you love me let me get back to you on that did I just get like phone friend zone? Let me get back to you on that, man. Get that out of here. Okay, this kid, whoa, what is this? It says, when I grow up, I want to be like mommy. And then there's like people in the crowd, they're like handing over dollars. I'm just saying, this might be like a white person strip club because they're like handing the money. You don't hand the money to the stripper. You throw it up, you make it rain, man. You're like. <laughs> There's an explanation, there's an explanation. It says, Dear Mrs. Jones, I wish to clarify that I am not now, nor have ever been an exotic dancer. I work at Home Depot. <laughs> That's a big difference from, you know, exotic dancing and, and, you know. And I told my daughter how hectic it was last week before the blizzard hit. I told her we sold out every single shovel we had. I found one in the back room and there were several people fighting over who would get it. Oh, okay, okay. In the picture, she's holding a shovel and people are like trying to buy the shovel. It's not a stripper pole. Oh, Dr. King had a dream. My dream is to work at Taco Bell with my mama. I like Taco Bell. Hey, where are my non-vegetarians at? At the top it says, use your own imagination to finish these similes. All right. Lucy broke her arm after falling off her skateboard. It hurt so bad. She said it felt like when Rhino rapes you. Whoa! Skirt, skirt. Okay, if you guys watched the last video about funny kid test answers, that was one where the kid wrote like how to rap a present, but they spelled rap with rape. So they put how to rape a present. This is probably that same kid. That's just a dark M. Night Shyamalan imagination right there. Here we go, say and write. Okay, C for cow, okay, B for bird, all right. C for cat, D for dog, F for duck. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, if you don't know by now, that is a duck. You're supposed to put a D for duck. Not an effort, you know good and well, this kid knew exactly what he was doing, okay? He just wanted an excuse to write the F word. Question, who was Adolf Hitler? And they drew a drawing of Adolf Hitler with a little stash and everything, and they put this person. <laughs> if I was a teacher grading this, I'd give him all the points. That's like a really good drawing of Hitler right there. Like, you know, he's got the mustache, got the got the hair parted to the side. Like, like, look at that. Maybe if they drew Hitler with like the body and like, you know, the uniform, then he probably would have gotten the points, so. Woo, that's it, that's it. Those were some more funny kid test answers. Had some savage ones in there, had some nasty ones like that. You know, like that STD one, but we're not gonna talk about that. But I really hope you guys enjoyed that video. Thank you for coming, thank you for watching. Really appreciate it. Notification squad, research squad, you guys are the best, you the best. I'm gonna have another new video on Saturday, 2 p.m. So make sure you guys, you know, get there. Make sure you guys put it in the calendar, you know, set the alarm and get there, you know, be the first to like and comment. And remember the Instagram following spree. So just follow me on Instagram. Let's try to get, I wanna to try to get up to that 100K. So with your guys' help, we can make it happen. But yeah, thank you guys again for watching. Really appreciate it. Make sure to check out another video. You can click right here or you can click right here. And if you're new, make sure to click the circle to subscribe and click that bell to get notified. And I'ma see you guys next time. Till then, peace.